Um, how did you approach, you know, things such as animations or, you know, gestures uh, to make it, you know, native-like? Because, it, you know, uh, may, maybe a bit more context to this question. You know, React Native obviously has those animations and stuff written in JavaScript. And, and just like we used to have issues with navigation where it didn't look native-like because it had animations re-implemented, mm -hmm. you know, this is the first thing that comes to my mind to, in terms of paper. So, uh, yeah, I, I mean, how did you approach that? Did you even have uh, this kind of a problem? And if yes, how did you manage to, you know, solve it? Um, so uh, when when the first version of React Native Paper was, was implemented, uh, only the animated library from React Native Core was available. Okay. And, and that's why um, all of the animations uh, uh, are implemented with this library. Uh, but of course, it doesn't mean they are slow or, or anything like that, uh, mm -hmm. because most of them, I mean, all maybe except one or two, uh, runs on the native thread. So uh, the performance is good. Uh, the animations are smooth. And yeah, I, I remember we, we were uh, considering migrating to React Native reanimated library uh, when the first version was released, because you know, uh, it was very popular, a lot of people, uh, a lot of developers adopted it very quickly. And we thought that maybe it's a good good, uh, good yeah. way of, of doing animations. But uh, overall, uh, we, we dropped this idea uh, because anyway, our, our animations runs on a native thread, so there wouldn't be any significant you know, performance improvements. Yeah, yeah, I see. I see that makes a lot of sense. Now, um, so so since you had to, you know, write these animations with animated library, uh, you kind of like this is this is I guess what what really makes me wondering. Like, did you have to reverse engineer the animation and just try to guess the values in animated to make it look like Material Design, or is there a Google owned specification that says this is how the animation should look like. Is there any info like that, or is it you know reverse engineering? How does it look like? Uh, so there is a material design website which contains a lot of useful information, mm -hmm. and yeah, the, the, there is also information about uh, specification of, of, of the animations, but oh. not, but not uh, unfortunately not for every component. So uh, for a few of them, uh, we had to do. Uh, some reverse engineering, and uh, I know that we uh, some of the animations are based on, on how things are implemented in the native Android uh, implementation mm -hmm. of material design. Okay, cool. I see. So at least you have some of the data available. So it's not that you have to reverse engineer everything. But anyway, uh, I guess you know uh, respect for you. Uh, to you and, and the whole team for doing that and 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 probably the community already I mean probably the community appreciates that as well since they are using paper